so let's peek in on the seedlings. I think y'all will be thoroughly surprised at what they look like. Let me knock some of that water off from the humidity. I'm gonna open it, it's still gonna drip water all over the place. I usually do this thing sideways, it's not as bad. But yeah, check them out. Oops. Not taking any of the bloopers out. <laughs> so I've been monitoring the humidity and the temperature here. But yeah, look at these. It's a Huguenot in uh, Clay County, Oreophila. Some flowers from, from Steve Gaelic. Look how, look how fast these things are growing. These are almost as tall as these guys. They're, they're catching up with them. But yeah, they're, they're pretty much ready to come out from under the humidity dome. I'll be taking them out soon. I've got some coming out of stratification the first week of March. So I'm gonna start weaning these off of humidity here uh, over the, the next week or so. But yeah, some of these are just gorgeous. I'm gonna pull this pot out real quick so you can see. Look at these. I posted a video on how these seeds are sown. It's 100% peat in these pots, topped with a layer of milled long fiber sphagnum moss. I put the long fiber sphagnum in a food processor, grind it up, put a little bit of water in there, and just grind it up into a paste. And that's what you end up with. I've got some slow germination on a few of them, like that pot right there a couple of these but for the most part i'm pretty i'm pretty satisfied with what i got i mean i'm one man and can only handle but so much as is anyway but yeah man i can't wait to get these guys out from under humidity get them start coloring up fertilizing them giving them that big boost with the max c Man, these, these three pots in the middle, I, I'm, I'm not mad at them at all. A couple of these down low, like that one, that's actually one of my crosses. These two are, uh, if I remember correctly, Huguenot by uh, Wilkinson Red Rocket, if I remember correctly. And then I think this one is Lunchbox by Wilkinson Red Rocket. 